They're now bu actually building a real home. In this Alberta warehouse, machines are assembling houses the same way they'd assemble a car. The same two robots are building all the 25 walls that are going into the same house. And you can see the, over there, we've got two more robots. They're building all the floors of the same house. Promise Robotics is developing ways to build housing using commercial mass-produced machinery, not custom. These robots basically have are off the shelf. The company says its AI software means these robots can complete dozens of tasks. We actually don't expect ever builders to learn about robotics, machinery, manufacturing, and that's why we think there is a scalable play here where you can now take it to many, many more builders and developers across US and Canada. This type of technology could speed up construction as Canada faces a housing crunch. It's not the only Canadian housing tech out there. Horizon Legacy develops technology that can pour concrete, a robot named Val. Val can lift 230 kilograms day in and day out, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. So she's taking uh, the manual labor intensive part, the backbreaking part. But. While broader industry players say robotics can speed things up, the investments are expensive and housing can be unpredictable. The industry is built to withstand boom bust uh, nature of the, in, of the housing market um, and large overhead becomes more difficult to be nimble. The Home Builders Association points out regulations and zoning are also ways to speed up construction, not just robots. But back at Promise, they say their tech can cut house construction time in half. They're basically like a Legos, right? Like once you produce those, then you're able to put them together really fast. Brick by brick or gear by gear. Ennis Hidari, CBC News, Edmonton.